Boom. Okay. That's it. We are rolling. What's up? Trying out this Audi hat. Really? Not my favorite. Not how I like my beaks to be, but whatever. I'm trying it out. So, you know what? I'm going to call this video the one thing I really don't like about my Audi TTRS. You know, my early first opinions of it. There is one thing I really don't like. Now, it's not the color. I like the color. It's a nice glacier white with the uh, black optics package on it. It's very cool. But there's one thing that totally gets on my nerves and surprises the living crap out of me for a vehicle that for the first time in my life, I dropped like 75 big ones on it. I'm gonna show you guys what it is. But hey, Lola, pass me that thing you have in your hand. It has something to do with this. This is my fix for that problem. So you know what, let's go inside the vehicle and I'll show you guys right now what I'm talking about. Lola's worried about the light change and the blah blah blah. So I like that, like I just put my hand under there, I got the key in my pocket of course. I like how it looks inside, it's so beautiful. Such a beautiful car. So go ahead, get in Lola, you can get in. Let's get in here. So, I don't know if you see it already, but do you see that thing? Like uh, I've had a bunch of different cars. I just saw a picture on Facebook today, actually, that uh, three years ago, I got the Challenger. The um, That was like a 2015 Challenger Scat Pack Edition. Beautiful car. I miss my Sasha Gray already. Of course, this I'm calling that Michelle Pfeiffer, that white gold. That's the name of this one, Lola. I don't like it. She doesn't like that either. Okay. So anyway, <laughs> with what I want to do in the, in the past here on the channel, because um, I do a bunch of other things, really my channel is lifestyle. So in the past, I didn't do as many car things as I wanted to do. I was uh, probably more focused on guns because that's, uh, of course, a big passion. My passions in life are guns, cars, art. And in that art category, you could put women because I think women are the most beautiful forms of art created by nature, God, and everything else out there. So anyway, I didn't focus too much. I've been fo I've been hyper focusing on the gun things, which I'm still gonna do. Never gonna stop. I believe in the Second Amendment. You're gonna have to take it from my cold dead hands. But we're gonna do more car stuff. So. Um, I'm gonna be doing a lot of these things and to make it easy with all the different editing I have to do I'm just gonna let it flow and well, whatever we say is what we say We're just gonna throw it up there and you guys could tell me what the hell you think about it All of this by the way is going on stranger palooza, which is my auto Channel so I will put some things over on the regular Hank strange channel But I'm gonna put more of the car stuff over here So I'm just gonna I'm just encouraging everyone with this video to go over to stranger palooza and subscribe follow that channel Because eventually that's where all the car stuff's gonna go. So here we go. Let's uh, jump into this here in the car So as you can see is there a reason why you're not closing the door Lola? She's letting more light in. She's letting more light in it doesn't didn't make that much difference. So check this out. So there's my radar detector very necessary to me here I'm gonna um, just turn the engine on let's, let's quiet Lola let's see how this sounds after like a whole week of me at SEMA the, the window the mirrors unfold out and the seat just hugged me yeah oh yeah <laughs> oh that you like huh yeah, I like that well, Lola likes when somebody hugs her just Oh, FYI, on. anyone out there who wants to know, she likes the hug. So there you go. So there goes my, um, this is, a, I have the uh, Escort 360. That's what my radar thing is. And you see the cable going out here. So now usually I have to deal with an obnoxious cable, right? It, it messes up the look of the car. But look, mine has to go all the way to back to the, because the freaking glove box is like all the way over here. Right? I don't know if you guys can see that here from that angle. So here we go. Here's the cord going all the way back, all the way back. This back here is where this this uh, glove box is. With one cigarette lighter. Yeah, with one cigarette lighter in it. So usually I have a, you always have a cable coming off and it goes down and hangs down so, somewhere there like that, right? So why did you open the door again? So that you can see. That people could see. Don't worry about it. 
All right, so usually, yeah, see Lola is just not understanding how we let the videos flow and we stop interrupting my genius when I'm flowing. So, so anyway, usually I have a cable hanging down, you know, of course that doesn't look the best. And people say to me, well, why don't you just, um, you know, what, why is this thing going on? Let me mute it. Yeah, so people say, well, why don't you just hardwire the radar detector to the car? Because in a couple of years, I'll probably be on to another car. So I'm not going to put that. I'm going to take my money and instead of getting rims. Usually I, I like to try to buy a car now and it has what I want on it. So instead of getting rims and, you know, <laughs> hard wiring things to the car and doing this thing and that thing, that's just going to be a whole bunch of money that when I go to, you know, trade up to a better car, because that's my plan to keep trading up till I get to uh, badass supercar territory. What? I don't want to do that. So anyway, we're going to deal with that and that's why we got this. This is my first try. You guys might have some better ideas out there for something temporary. I want to do temporary things. I don't want to do ter permanent stuff to fix it. So I'm going to go with this. This is basically an extension cable and I got it from Amazon. I don't know. Made in China. There you go. I'm looking at what the name of it. It's called uh, Nylite. So um, you know what? Here Lola, you take the camera and roll on me. I will, so I'm going to unplug from here, I'm going to unplug this from there, so I should shut that off, open this up real quick, uh, yes it is, Lola says this is really too big and bulky, it this is. this might have been nice if they made this flat, they could have made the cables for this flat, well, so it's thinner, I mean, in this day and age, why does it have to be so massive? I think it has to be a certain gauge, just because of uh, of what it has to do. Yeah, but look, but, at the, look at the cord that already comes with the radar. It's so thin. listen, don't be mad. Don't be mad at the. Don't be mad at the people who make the cord. Be mad at the people who made the Audi and didn't put a freaking. Didn't put the lighter. Why not put it on the side, Audi? Come on. Yeah. So yeah, that's not. That's still not gonna close down all the way. And, and then. This excess. So now, yeah, I'm gonna have some extra cable. Look, there's a little pocket thing over here. Yeah, so what I'm gonna do is these little, I'm gonna take one of these little twisties and actually I'll take both of them. Yeah. And I'll uh, wrap this, I'll wrap this back up right now so it doesn't look, it's gonna look terrible. When I go to get the windows tinted, I'll show you guys that as well because I have to get the windows tinted and I just made an appointment for that. The guy's gonna be like, wow, this is real ghetto. Yeah. <laughs> this is a real it's ghetto. Nice ass car. <laughs> this is a real ghetto fix. Yeah. Totally. Whatever. Yeah, I don't like it. I'm not putting in a permanent solution. I can tell you that right now. Uh, let me see if this can get into this mesh here. Yeah, we can make it get in there. Hang on, let me help you. No, I got it. Maybe I don't got it. Okay, you know what? We'll put it. You see if you can get it in there. I will. Well, the mesh is not very deep. Yeah, the mesh isn't that big. I There's don't know a what lot you of put in there. depth to it. Food for your supermodel chick. If you got a supermodel chick, which would be what? If you got like <laughs> a cracker, a couple of crackers, what? Yeah. If you got like a thunder thighs chick, like what I like. Yeah, well. That thunder thighs. Is. They need food. Yeah, we need food. <laughs> they need food. So anyway, so here, hold this right here. Get that back. Just hold it. Um. Move your hand from the thing. Yeah, there you go. All right, so I'm just gonna hold on one second. Here, just go ahead. Point here. Just point it at me and look at the thing. Okay, so I'm just gonna plug that in. Boom. Should come on. There we go. There it it's getting powered up. So did this wind up fitting in there? I guess yeah, it did, right? It did. It didn't make it fit. Yeah. I mean, and I could tuck this over here or whatever I want to do. A little bit little, out of the way. It's another little no, no, it's not enough. No. They should have just I mean, why not do some side things, man? Or just put the put the cigarette lighter down here. You know, it'll make things so much easier, but whatevs. That's too easy for them. But you know what? In the end, I don't know. I still don't like how this is. Oh, I think it just went into S1. I think that's sport. It's the Sportronic or whatever they call it. We'll see. Because right now it's just in the uh, it's it just in the first gear. We'll see. We'll go for a little drive and try it out.
right, so I hope you guys enjoyed that little quick ride in the uh, Audi TT RS. Um, you know, I did figure out how to do launch control. The only thing is, you know, I, I didn't want to show it. I will show that later. We'll do some uh, launch control somewhere. Of course, obeying the speed limits. You know, but it's, rel it's relatively easy to do. So there you go. One thing so far that I don't like about the Audi TT RS. What can I say? We're going to try to hack it till it's perfect. Probably never be perfect, but it's still fun. Peace. Yeah, it's still running. Still running. Check that out. Got closed on. Yeah, it's still cooling it down. Don't forget. Subscribe to Stranger Palooza.